I've spent countless hours gathering resources, traveling between the planet's core and the surface, crafting items and sending them. All this work and everything could have been so much easier. If only I knew this little trick before completing Estronier's breakdown event. I am of course talking about automation. As you know, rarer items give you more points and the burrito is as rare as items can get. That's why I've built this awesome automation that unloads your rover or train and crafts burritos automatically. Next I'll show you exactly how it works and how you can build this in your own Estronier world. Now before we start here's a schematic of how it should look in the end and here's a list of all the items you are gonna need in order to craft this. To make it easier I have divided it into three categories. First of all we have the unloading area which is this part right here. If you are using a train then you will need a rail station and you'll have to set it to unload stopped cars. If you are using a rover you can just park it in this purple area right here and yeah that's basically all you need to do if you are using a rover. The auto arms will automatically take all of the materials from your train or rover and it will send it to the next section. And that is the tier 1 and 2 section. That's this path from right here with all of these auto arms. Here we are crafting all of the tier 1 and 2 items. And then these auto arms have very specific materials in their selector slot so that they can only take those ones. The rest of them will go into the small and medium printers. Then we can move over to the tier 3 section and that's these two platforms right here with the auto arms in the middle. Here we are crafting Omnagets and then burritos. And that brings us to the very end of it where we are storing our burritos and then we can use our exo request platform to send them. I know it maybe sounds complicated but I assure you it's not. And once you've built it everything becomes so much easier and the event will be completed in a matter of hours. That's of course if you've also watched my breakdown strategy video where I talk about the exact train sitting right behind me and the strategy for using it in order to complete the event faster and easier. So if you combine these two strategies you should have no trouble completing the event. As you can see the auto arms are unloading everything from our train and all you need to do is just set the canisters to enable output and with the rail station set to unload stopped cars everything will come this way. At the first platform we are crafting Squashotane, Cosmic Automaton, Cosmic Squash and Noxomaton 2. These all get fed into the second platform where we are crafting Omnugget. And then all of these materials get fed into the third and last platform where we craft our burritos. You can see a burrito crafting right here and that's basically how it works. It goes through all of the platforms. But make sure you also take a look at all of these auto arms and the items they have in the selector slots. Setting these up correctly is really important. Otherwise you will get it screwed up with the tier 1 items in the third platform. Trust me it took me a while to figure that out. But it's gonna be a lot easier for you if you know it from the beginning. You can see the whole farm in action right here. I've also removed my head so it's not distracting while well, you can watch this thing working. And this is an earlier version of the farm from when I was actually completing the event. Now I'm all done with it. We have over 1 million points. But in this earlier version I tried automating the exo request platform which as you might know from a lot of my previous videos is not possible. For whatever reason I forgot that and I tried to do it all over again. Of course I failed, like the fourth time in the past year. I'm not proud of that. But let's move on. That's how it works, the design is pretty simple. Make sure to go back in the video and check out the schematic and the list of items that you're gonna need in order to build this. And you can watch through it again and build it along with me. If you want to see me complete the entire breakdown event, then check out this playlist right here. Or if you are not into that then click on this other video on the right side. Whichever one you choose, I'll see you there and cheers Estroniers!